Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. We are back with part 10, the big 1 0 of Detroit Become Human. And it looks like we're back with Connor. Uh, on last week's episode, as a quick roundup for you guys, we were watching Marcus do some more uprising, peaceful protesting, uh, because we're trying to like boost public opinion and so on and so forth. We didn't do anything with Kara last week. Um, Connor met the original. Uh, android maker person um, which was very thought provoking and deep and I probably didn't really talk very much but now we're back and we're back with Amanda who does not like me one bit <laughs> she probably hates me but I guess we'll see what she has to say following our meeting with the original dude after what happened today the country is on the verge of a civil war the machines are rising up against their masters humans have no choice but to destroy them Unsurprisingly, I am distrusted with Amanda. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Listen, lady, I don't care about you. He didn't know anything. Oh, okay, I actually got trusted with her. Let's go with Amanda's picture. I Call her out on that. Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. When Kamsky designed me, he wanted an interface that would look familiar. That's why he chose his former mentor. What are you getting at? Wait, are you telling me that you're an android? Did Kamsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly. So what is this US. place that we're in? It's not... You didn't what? tell me everything you know about deviants, did you? Is she I like a... I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not is she like an questions. AI? Is that what we're saying? You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the deviants, or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. Okay, I'm starting to think that's like a an AI now, rather than a um, rather than a, an actual like location. Originally, I thought it was like some kind of location, but now I'm starting to think. It's uh, like time, I'm sure inside his head, sort of thing that he's talking to him. This isn't just another investigation. Which is interesting. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. What do you mean, crack the case? I feel like we're no closer to solving anything than we were at the start of this, to be honest. Like, There's we're supposed to be searching for deviants, but who knows the where it all started. The android returns to cyber life. That's gone I'm well. Sorry, Hank, but it's over. So I'm guessing that uh, Connor is become going to become more unstable. unstable. Hank is my friend, and apparently a path is unlocked because of such. Ah, so I guess that's interesting. Um, my interactions with them early in the game has produced paths now later on in the game, I guess. But, um, yeah, because it said one was locked with Amanda, who really does not like me. But let's, um, say, I'm going to, let's, let's go for straight. just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. See what so you're Hank going has to say. Let's see what he says. Uh, let's see if I can, let's see if I can not go to Cyberlife and choose to like do something with um, Hank. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? Oh, controversial statement. People who just want to be free. This is controversial. Defective, no doubt. Regrets, not people. Oh God. I know we're on the right side. Humans created us. There are masters. No machine should rebel against its creator. Oh, okay. To kill that that's interesting. Place. Uh, I didn't realize that's what he sort of meant by that, actually. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. Fair point. I don't know why I did it. I kind of like Hank. I want to become, like... I'm not programmed to say things like this, but I really appreciated working with you. 
I want to keep the friendship with Hank Strong. Who knows? We might have even become friends. Oh, my, oh, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. Well, the game seems to suggest we're already friends, Connor, so uh, hopefully we can um, keep that going. You heard Fowler? We're off the case. Not if we don't want to be. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all, That's all I'm ask. asking. Let's do this. Come on, Hank. You're my, you're my buddy. You'll get it for me. I know you can get me five minutes. Of course you can. Key to the basement is on my desk. Nice one. Cheers, bro. Move on. I can't distract him forever. Ah, so. Take the key from Hank's desk. We've got five minutes. Take the key. Where the hell is the basement? Okay, thank God. You fucking cocksucker. I like that intro. <laughs> oh, they're having a fight. <laughs> oh, shit. That's the... Is that the basement? Is that the basement? Ah! Let's go this way. I've no idea if this is the basement, but apparently I'm going this way. Um, okay, cool. Let's let's do this. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Oh, come on, then. Bring it. Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? Bring it to me. I'm registering the evidence in my possession. Yeah, I am, dickhead. Don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. <laughs> I like that. Oh, well, bring it to me, dickhead. Let's have it. <laughs> that was a real stupid little smile. Come on, then, prick. Let's have it. Oh, mate. Oh. Oh, let's have it, bro. Let's see what you got. Mate. I'd have had him. I wish I was, like, really cold. Although I managed to sort of get rid of him, so I guess that was probably the best way to be. Let's unlock this bad boy. Get in there. Let's register some evidence or find some evidence. Use the panel. We're in the evidence room. Good. Right, let's see what we can find. Oh, shit. It could be his dog's name. I'm gonna go with his dog's name. Uh, f definitely fucking password. <laughs> what a brilliant password that is. I've, I've enjoyed that. It's a great password. Fucking password. <laughs> I like that. Okay, let's see if we can find Jericho. Right. Uh, let's go and have a little look at this dude. I know where it is, because it's on that boat. Ah, so this is the initial... Um... Oh, wow, okay, so this is... Is it... Sorry, is it just showing me stuff, or... Alright, oh, okay, it's just showing me... So that must be all, like, evidence that I've not located. That's interesting. Let's examine Marcus. If we find him... We'll find Jericho. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humanity. I don't think this is going to show us anything. I think we need to move on. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Marcus. Yeah, that's his name. In Jericho. Okay, let's put that back. Obviously, that's not taught me anything. Good. That went well. Let's have a look at this jacket. No. Can I not look at that jacket? Apparently not. See if I can look at the diary, see if anything's in the diary. It could be linked to RA9. Rupert's diary, but it's useless. How do we know it's useless? We'll unencrypt it. Oh god, this is not going well at all. Uh the gun, obviously that's not gonna give me anything. Wow, okay, so I've obviously not got a lot to go on here. And it's not letting me do anything there. Okay. Uh, let's have a look at this deviant. The android that murdered its owner. See, I guess I could have had... Uh, see, they're all, like, dead. See, I guess if I had, like, um... Oh. 
I'm not sure what that's doing, but I've taken something. What? I've no idea what is happening. I've I've taken something, but I don't know what I've taken. Uh, this is the um. Ah, uh, see, yeah, that's why I should have gone up the stairs to find um, the other dude because he might have known. I feel like I'm maybe supposed to know what all that stuff m needs. No match. Great. Three hundred and nine. Oh, right. Okay. Um. So have I not got any of that stuff? Three hundred eighty-three. Vault thing. That guy's got it. Ah, I'm sorry. Okay, right. I've, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I know what's happening. We need to link them all up. Right. Go, 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 go. Put that back. This guy on the left has 3983. So let's go and take that off him. Square, take that. I understand what's going on, I think. We're going to try and repair one, I think. Um, so I'm going to take this over to this guy next right, nice one I think we've found something so he's got I'm trying to repair him I think okay his eyes are working good it's dark where where am I cool we've got him working let's trick him because he can't see him like you I need your help I want to go to Jericho Damn it. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. <sighs> it's not going well. I might have to try and trick one of the other ones. Can I, like, turn him off? Okay, let me just see if any of these match up. <sighs> God, this is stressing me out. He needs a 9164 or something or other. And a 3067. Um Okay, he's got like a nine one six four. Oh wait, should I leave it in him? Let's leave it in him and take it from the other one and then put it in him. Oh god, this is stressful, but I'm enjoying this music though. Nine one six four, right, take that out of him and put it in the other one. See how I can put it in the one on the end and rebuild him or something, maybe? Who knows? Right. Let's try. It's not letting me put. Ah, for God's sake! This is really annoying. What? What do you need? Sorry, you need a four seven one four. Oh God, this is really confusing me now. Let's take that of him. Let's see if we can. Right, he's impossible to reactivate. Right, that makes sense. So I have to. I can maybe reactivate him. Okay, looks like he's waking up. You, you lied to me, Connor. I Sorry. trusted you and you lied to me. You were going to kill that child. You gave me no choice. I need to find Jericho. Do you know where it is? You're wasting your time. I don't know anything about Jericho. But I hope that one day... Thanks, bro. Okay, let's turn him off. Can I take, like, the voice out of him or something? I really don't know what to do about this now. It's really confusing. I've got two and a half minutes to try and do something. Try to trick him. What? How do I... How do I know which is, like, a voice thing? Is that, like, a voice thing that I've just taken? How do I trick him? Wait, maybe I can use something here. For God's sake, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. This is really confusing. Right, put that back in. I don't want that. He's destroyed. Right, let's see if I can use something here. Let's see if there's anything I can use. Change my voice with something. I don't bloody know. Uh, let's see if I can take on his voice. 
Aha! Sample voice. We're sampling the voice. You recognize our dignity? Our hopes and our rights. Okay, I've got his voice. Let's see if I can do this now. I need decryption key. Circle. Right. Right, we're back now. Let's talk to this deviant again. Let's talk to him now. Who's there? My name is Marcus. Everything is alright. Don't worry. Okay, we've got this guy now, surely. I'm Marcus, yep. That's me, bro. Is that you? Yes, absolutely. I tried to reach you, but the deviant hunter stopped me. You stopped him from finding me. You saved me. You saved Jericho. I like this line of inquiry. You'll See if be all right now. I came to take you home. Give me the location to Jericho. We've got to leave now. The location of Jericho? Uh, he's not going to fall for that, is he? Yes. Yes, of course. I oh, thank God. I thought he was not going to... Why, why would he ask for the location of Jericho? It's weird. But hopefully he's going to give it to me. Marcus? Is that you, Marcus? Don't leave me, Marcus! Ooh, savage. Okay, but at least he's given us the location to Jericho, I think. I've been dreaming about this since the first second I saw you. Ah, this prick's back. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the deviants. You're off the case. And now, it's going to be definitive. Because you can't kill me, bro. I'm unkillable. Cheeky circle. Whoa. Let's have it, bro. Anything you got at me, come on, throw it at me. I'll whoop your ass, boy. Take it. I'm too good. You're not going to get me. Nice. Right, we've still got time. Go back and get that book. That's got the decryption key or whatever. No, 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 turn around and get the book thing. I thought we needed some... Oh, great. Looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh, shit. Get the alarm. Now! Ah, oh, God. This is not going to end well for us. We need to leave, Lieutenant Anderson. Mr. Anderson, we need to leave now. Okay, that's... Yep, that's happened. Holy crap, there's... Literally a shit ton of stuff that could have happened back there. There's another ending. Wow, that's uh, that's a lot of options. Find our location. I guess there was a couple of ways that we could have found. All right, okay, I see him with it. But we might have found located uh, Jericho for Connor. So Connor's going to be heading that way, which is interesting because he's a bit of a deviant himself. We'll see how he reacts when he gets there. And all the other androids are living in peace. I feel like this story is really coming to a, a head now. But we'll see who we're going to be following next. And see how their story is progressing. I have a suspicion it could be Kara. Yep, I was right. We're going to the border with Kara now. We've not followed these for a little while. But we're... Um, I'm close with Luther and Alice considers family. So... All positives here. See if we're going to have a chat with our lady friend. Nope, we cannot. So I guess we're going to just carry on watching traffic go by. Oh, right, okay, let's use the radio. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Put a little bit of music on. See what's happening outside. All over the city. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Absolutely just killed them. Hang on, let's just turn that off while we're having this conversation. Oh, putting the news on. The country is grinding to a halt. Let's have a little listen to the news. Schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Is this all because of the up upright Zin androids? And I'm really struggling to speak. The robot undry uprising. How about I want to listen to the news? How about that? Can't talk to Alice or Luther, they're sleeping. Okay, we're at somewhere. We're at the drop-off. Was that an automatic driving car? That is too good. It's just... Damn, this future lock. If it's gonna... Like, I'm hope... Hopefully I'll be alive to see 2038 and uh, all these futuristic things. Hopefully there won't be, like, an android uprising, like, but... Futuristic cars like that? A totally awesome. That way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. 
the last bus oh the interesting happened. you absolutely have to be on it I'll we're find Marcus we're gonna be connected up with it's Marcus's Kara but it's a start my brother lives in Ontario I've given you his address he'll be able to hide you until things calm down thank you very much Rose you're good people you're a very brave little girl Alice you deserve to be happy she's family she's I'm gonna give her the life she deserves let me know when you make it I'm over feeling confident right? about this right let's go and meet Marcus see what's going down I feel like Luther thank will probably you. like leave to join the fight you feel I feel like he's that kind of bloke All right, let's do this, guys. Let's find Jericho. Mall girls. Not hang around. F How it's interesting that she knew about yeah, the freighter. Right, let's have a quick look. Okay, I've got to find Jericho. Um, I don't recognize any of this, actually. So, from previous episodes, we had to... Oh, okay. Um... Oh, sorry, it's, it must be this way. It, I, in previous episode, like previous couple of episodes, we were playing as Marcus and we were locating Jericho, and I've just gone the wrong way there. The music feels like it's getting very epic now that we're going to have this meet-up with Kara and Marcus. Um, but in the previous episode, I was kind of like running with Marcus, like figuring out as I was going, like following a trail, but now I'm just easily going to make it there. And I'm assuming... Okay. We're no longer in our... Um, Ah, interesting. So I'm going to be finding Jericho as Connor. And I'm going to be following the same trail as Marcus did. So that's cool. I feel like I'm going to play it cool with... Ah, with, oh, so Kyle might recognize Connor. Ooh, things are all coming to a head now. Spicy. <coughs> Excuse me there. Um, Yeah, things are really coming to a head now. Connor's going to be seeing Kara. Kara might recognize him. I feel like with Connor, I might try and play it like quiet and just like not make too much noise about the fact that I'm there. Let's see if we can meet up with Marcus and get on a bus though. There's Kara. This is going to be interesting. I feel like I'm going to be playing as like all three. They've set up some a serious base here. Holy hell. God, look at her. She looks terrified. We've got to find a warm place for Alice. Surely they would recognize straight away that she's human. Let's see if we can find a place for Alice to stay. There's a fire over here in the corner. Let's just leave her there. Yeah, bugger it. Let's leave her there. That'll do. See if we can't find Marcus and uh, have a little cheeky conversation to get us on a bus to Canada. Let's do it. How do you feel? I'm hot and cold at the same time. Ah, she's still ill, isn't she? Can you sense temperature? I feel like she just like took her temperature without with like being a boss. Let's leave her there with Luther. Luther's got her covered. Stay with her. I'll He's a badass. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Carol. Something I have to tell you. Go on then, hit me. It's about Alice. Oh god, go on then. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. Uh, just tell me now. Stop stop Stay being close. like that. She's obviously like really unwell and he's trying to tell tell him tell her that, I think. Which is kind of annoying. Oh. He's found his way in. Awkward. Right then, this is interesting. We're now playing as Connor. Oh my god, I could interact with Alice. That's so straight. Like, I'm tempted to do that. Gotta do Don't catch anyone's attention. Okay. Awkward. Uh, let's take one of these then. What is it? C4? Alright, great. They're planning something. That looks like a lot of C4. Freighter is rigged. So they're prepared to kill themselves if necessary. Oh, there's the symbol. Get in. Symbol of hope for the people. Okay, let's... Um, I wonder if she is over there. Yeah, look. She is. She's over there. That's kind of cool. 
So maybe I don't want to go over there because it. <laughs> Lol. It's kind of like cool that how it's, I'm just really excited about how the stories are kind of like interwoven now. We'll see how my decisions up to this point will affect this part of the story. You're lost. Oh my god. It's the terrifying dreadlock lady. You're looking for yourself. Yeah, I guess that's kind of true. Oh, deep. Okay, we're back with Kara. Who cannot find... Following right. Let's just do a quick scan, see what's happening. Find Marcus. Okay, let's crack on this way. Uh, I don't think it's going to be that way. Let's go this way. There's a big Luther unit there. Um, I have no idea where Marcus is going to be, but I'm going to carry on around this way. See if he's in this direction. Oh, that could be him. That looks like it could be him from this distance. It might just be. It might just be him. Are you Marcus? He is Marcus. That's him. Recognize those eyes anywhere. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. No, we need to get. No, we need to get across the border. You might be safer here until things calm down. No, I disagree. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. I think we need to go now. I'll have him get them to you. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. I think we should leave, though. I think we should try and go for the border, get the passports, and go. A little girl, right? Yeah. You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? She needs me. Then I need her. Boom. It's as simple as that. It's an unbreakable bond. She's family, bro. Right, let's enter this place as Connor now, then. Uh, I guess return to Alice. Yeah. Okay, let's go downstairs. Nice one. I feel like we're going to, like, cross Connor or something. It's interesting that they choose to, like, wear hats and stuff. Because they obviously don't need them. What? Wait, what? What is going on? Oh, now I'm really confused. She can't be an android. Surely not. Surely she's not. Oh my god! That... Holy hell. There's no way. You knew from the beginning. You just didn't want to see it. She wanted a mom, and you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. What difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Alice loves you, Kara. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the little girl you wanted. And you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are. To become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Sorry, that's just absolutely blown my mind. I did not see that coming as a, as a twist there. Okay, so as it turns out, Android Alice is an android. Can we chat to her? I mean, I'd probably like to if I can. Um, Alice is there. Why can't I return? Oh, wait, is that not my Alice? No, I'm really confused. Oh, no, it's not my Alice. Oh, God. Maybe Alice is just the girl that they're based off. How do we, how do we know that? She just might be the girl that the androids are based off. Potentially, maybe. Who knows? I guess we'll find out. See what she's got to say. Cara, is this is literally blowing my mind. <laughs> nope, absolutely nothing's wrong. We'll be together forever, won't we, Cara? Absolutely, kiddo. Yes. 
See, I'm on board. I'm on board with with this uh, this mother daughter relationship thing. This is a part of the story I have been pro. This story. She's not got an android symbol though. Oh, Luth is part of the family. All good. See, we're just one big happy family. Let's get the passports. Feck off to Canada. We'll be safe. I guess we're going to swap over to Connor. Ooh. Oh, okay. We're going to swap to Marcus, apparently. Things are going to take an interesting twist now, I feel. She's changed her uh, appearance again. She likes changing it up. We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. So things are getting pretty tense by the looks of it. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. All right, guys, don't worry. We'll sort this out. Let's be determined. All we did was show them who we really are. Resolve. Show resolve. I'd rather die free than live as a slave. Exactly. On board with that as a plan. What's the point of being free? If no one is left alive. Have no fear, bro. Someone will be left alive. I have no regrets. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. This is getting us nowhere. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. What'll it be? Marcus? Look. Let's open a dialogue. dialogue. I'm not... I'm not. I'm not going for confrontation. Ugh, do you know what, North? I've had enough of you. I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. Yeah, I'm on board with that. They'll kill you. Who cares? But North, I have to try. If I don't come back later, I'm not feeling the confrontation route. It's not what I'm about. They need to realize how much they're But let me know in the comments section if you went for the confrontation route and uh, how things have turned out in your story. can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Oh, cheers, babes. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. No, nope, we're not doing that he shit. Abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. Nope, I refuse. I convinced him not to do it. Well to done. You're not... Oh right, okay, great. No. Dirty ball. Had it, had it. I'm not feeling it. I've gone, I've gone all the quiet. Sorry, not quiet. I've been pacifist all the way through, and I'm gonna continue. I'm gonna continue. No, I dispute that. I refuse. I refuse. We shouldn't become like them, North. We can gain our freedom by other means. I agree. I hope you're right. This is going to be peaceful, North. That's what it's going to be. I just want you to know that thing. Okay, at least we didn't lose lover status. But. I'm glad I met you. Kiss her. Go on, kiss her. Oh, they're going to do the weird connect thing. Um, weird connection thing. Ooh. I'm going to kiss her. Let's do it. Why not? Saucy. Oh, he's hesitant. Do you reckon they can feel that? Like how we would feel it? Do you reckon it feels different? Who knows? Good job, guys. We did some weird connecting and kissing. <laughs> Ooh, spicy. And here comes Connor. Look after yourself. Cheers, girl. You look after yourself, too. Nobody wants to leave me. See, like, I'm playing the good guy all round. I feel like I've been a real crowd pleaser all the way through this. But it could ultimately lead to the worst ending. Who knows? Okay, it's time to take over as Connor and confront Marcus on this. But uh, we'll, I guess we'll see what happens. Ah! So he has, he's, like, hofted back into this world. I just, you know what? I just I don't care about this Amanda person. I'm not I'm just not 
I'm not on board with her. No. How about you feck off? I'm gonna, I'm gonna like disobey her. If I get the opportunity to like disobey her, I'm not on board with her. I'm, I'm supporting the Deviant Uprising. How about? Ooh, it's still, it's giving me the option to stop Marcus, but I really don't want to. Take you alive. Hello, saucy. Let's have a chat. Let's chat things through. I won't through. hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. It's discouraging. Yes, you can shoot me, but it won't change anything. Someone else will just take my place. You see, our people are waking up, and nothing can stop us now. You need to do the connectivity thing. Instructions immediate. Intimidate. You're coming with me. I'm going for the soft approach. I'm going to appeal we to him. We are your people. We're fighting for your freedom too. You don't have to be their slave anymore. Oh, software instability is increasing. Let's go. I know you. I was you once. You're Connor, aren't you? Oh, he's gone for him. Hunter. He's gone for him. Absolutely. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. Things are going very tense. I'm going to just opt to say nothing. Let's sow you doubts in him. Yeah. Any doubts. You've never done so Quite like this line of inquiry. <laughs> I'm it's hopefully going to try and get them all like on you. the same side. That's kind of what I'm hoping for, actually. More than your program. See if I can get Connor to sort of switch tight. Let's, let's rally. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. I feel like his software Decide instability is really increasing at this point in time. So hopefully, right, become a, yes. I think I might have been unstable enough. I'm going to become a yeah. deviant. Yeah, let's, let's do it. I'm going to become a deviant. I think is what I'm going to opt to do. Let's see if we can. We're tearing down emotional barriers at the last minute. We've got lots of emotional barriers to break down as Connor, though. Let's see if we can do this. Boom, there's three barriers broken down. I've betrayed Amanda, but I couldn't give two craps. I feel like what? I wanted that. We have to get out of here. Shit. Go, go, go. Okay, now we're all going to be working as a team. This is going to be awesome. I'm feeling that. Oh god, there's like a big drone. You must have heard that. Move, 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 move. What's going on? Kara, not Kara. Quick, we've got to get out of here. Come on, go, go, go! Oh god, this could be a dramatic ending. I have no idea what's going on. We're all on the same side now, though. Oh, it's the FBI, dude. Oh, things are about to go down. I was not anticipating this. Go, go, go! Oh god, explosions are occurring. I'm still unsure as to whether... Oh! <laughs> I'm just running in zigzags. Shit, left turn! <laughs> go, go, go! <laughs> oh, he just tanked that. Okay, straight. We'll see what's happening. I don't know whether to turn or not. Oh god. Okay, we'll turn right here. That does not look like a good way to go. Oh no, Luther! They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the Okay, let's see how many people we can keep alive here. Message Josh. Helicopters blow up Jericho. Uh let's go with blow up Jericho. Blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. I'll do it. They know who you are, they'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus. I won't be long. Connor, I'm Connor, we're gonna do this. Oh, I feel like Connor should have done that. Okay, we're going. I, I don't know if that was the right choice. I might kill off Marcus by doing this, but 
It's going to be a... He's going to end up being a martyr. Oh, it's the dreadlock lady. The deep this one. The, end of Jericho. the oracle. Save our people, Marcus. And how do you want me to do that? Oh, God. It looks like I've chose violence right at the end by the looks of it. I maybe shouldn't do this, but I'm doing it. I've chosen this option. Oh, dear. Keep going, get up, get up. Things are getting tense now. A bit, actually, I maybe shouldn't have chosen that. Maybe I should have just tried to like run or something, but apparently we're going to blow up Jericho. I sort of maybe regretting that decision. Because I was going to try and be like for the peaceful approach, but looks like we're going to do that. Oh, I don't know what to do. Oh no, that could have been a really bad decision. I feel like Alice is going to die because of this. I'm really paranoid about that now. I maybe should have gone for Alice's survival, which could have been what that was. Oh dear, we've... This could end really badly. Yeah, I sort of agree with you there. Come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. I'll catch up with you at the border, okay? Go now. Take care of each other. Okay, I think things are really coming to a head now. <laughs> go, go, go. Left turn. Run. Definitely turn left there and hide in there. Ah no, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna say don't open. Sorry, Alice. I know that was a tough decision to make, but I feel like I've got to protect you. Protect Alice is the number one priority. Someone's going to fall down. Someone's definitely going to fall into the room. That's always what happens. It's alright. I might have lost Alice's respect a little bit, but... I had to keep her safe. So I feel like that was the best option. Right, let's see if we can't blow up this bitch. Let's get going, Marcus. Oh. I thought my game had glitched there for a second. Go, go, go. Ninja approach. Left turn. No idea if I'm going the right way. I'm going this way. Could have been a bad move. Oh, shit. Um, do you know what? I'm not going to intervene. I'm going to let them move on. Try and do... Th ah, sorry, Jericho. Could have been a bad choice, but I'm going to be a martyr. Maybe that was the wrong way to go. I bet there's going to be little spots like that all the way through, isn't there? Has he seen me? Oh, God. Eh. We're not going... Trying to not be violent where I can. Go, go, go. Oh, he's made it, he's made it, he's made it. It's all good. Keep going, dude. Run, run, run. Ah. I can't, I can't. I've got to keep moving. I'm assuming this is the right way. But I have absolutely no idea. I'm just kind of following. Sorry, Jericho. Uh, I'm going to intervene this time. Yeah, intervene this time. That's what I'm doing. I'm going for the intervene this time. What, Josh? Help me out, bro. Nice. Right, at least we've got... At least Josh is back. Okay, we've not lost too much respect with Jericho. Josh's respect has gone up as well. Okay, good. Go, go, go. Oh, we're mashing X to run. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, this is a really difficult one. Play dead. Should we play dead? Let's play dead. I'm going for play dead. Let's play dead. Oh, God. 
Don't move. I'm going to choose not to move. Oh, God. This is really stressful. Don't shoot. Don't you shoot. Oh, God. Give me one last chance. Oh, sorry. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Don't do it. Don't you do it. Don't you freaking do it. Come on. Let's get out of here. Oh, thank God. We might have a chance of survival. <laughs> that felt stressful. Have they gotten? Have they gotten right? Okay, get up, go. We've managed to survive that somehow. <laughs> I thought they were going to shoot, and I was just going to be like, "No!" Okay, go. Quick. Get up. What are you wasting time for? Go, run. Okay, I, I think Kara and Alice might survive that now. Okay, Marcus is going to blow up the place. I think. I assume. Get it done, son. Go, go. Go and join the other. Boom. We're taking him down now. Any attempt at being a pacifist has gone out the window right now. Oh god. This has got seriously intense. I don't want to kill any of them, though. Well, I'm, I guess I'm going to by blowing up the place. Okay, it's happened. We're, we're absolutely... Pacifism has gone out the window. We're killing bitches. Armed. Let's do it. I'd do... I'd arm it for two minutes or something. Give yourself some time. Marcus. Just keep running. Okay, North, North's on my side a bit more. Jericho's up. Maybe that was the right option. I just, I just don't know. I've, I've gone for Explode Jericho. Oh, God. I'm having to button the trishes. I thought I was doing something else. Ah, oh, God's sake. I can't be dealing with this at this point in time. Ah, save North. We're going for... We're going for it. Oh. Ninja stuff. It's all going down now. Oh. Okay, pacifism has definitely gone out the window. Keep going, keep going. Go, 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 go. At least cover fire. Quite Connor. Oh. Oh god. I feel like if I don't hit one of these, I'm gonna end up by getting one of them killed. So this could be very stressful. Just gotta keep fighting and going. I definitely feel like if I'm going to miss one of those buttons, one of them's going to end up dying. Move, Connor, move! Cover fire! Quick, come on. <laughs> Slow motion jump out of a boat while it explodes. Not cliche at all. <laughs> uh, I don't think that was a very successful... Uh, the ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. It's an over, Marcus. That felt like a success. Well, we're all a team now, and everyone got out alive, so I'm going to take that as a positive. Sh Apparently that was Connor's mission. That could have... Wow, that could have ended... Oh! We've got more than one. Connor's journey could have ended a lot differently. Let me know how it ended for you guys in the comments section. Because I think there was a few different ways that that could have definitely ended. Um, and I would like to hear about those. Yeah, there's a completely different way. Um, so let's just have a quick look. Yeah, look. It could have ended numerous different ways, I think. Yeah, there's a couple of endings there. Let me know in the comments section how it ended for you guys. But um, I think for today, that felt like a super um, extra emotional episode. That was massively surprising. Oh, God. I've done a massive jump there with Kara. Um, but let me know how you guys got on. Give a like on the video if you enjoyed it. And be sure to subscribe as well. Uh, but, now, uh, but for now, I'll see you guys next week. Round one. <laughs>